have a new chapter now in the nationwide baby formula shortage. Parents with new worries about their baby's health after two infants were hospitalized as a direct result of the lack of formula. Meantime today, Congress taking up the issue during a meeting with the FDA commissioner and News Nation's Brooke Schaefer joining us now. So what more should parents know? Well, Nicole, I spoke to a doctor this afternoon. He told me there is serious concern for a specific group of babies here in the U.S. He said babies that have specific medical conditions or serious allergies and are on a specific formula can't just switch to another one very easily. He said switching their formula or not finding it at all could lead to serious problems. It could leave them very sick. Here's what he said some parents could see. Usually they can see a complete rush in their body, they can see vomiting, a diarrhea. That is Dr. Gonzalez Valina. He is a pediatric gastroenterologist at Nicholas Children's Hospital in Miami. He's been a doctor for several decades, and he told me he has never seen anything like this. He said he can't even believe this is happening in the U.S. He said parents, especially parents of babies with medical needs or allergies, have a right to be concerned. Of course, they have a reason to be concerned. I mean, I have a say, don't mess with success. If my kid is doing good on this formula, why change it? And especially before six months of age. And that doctor did say, even though there is a risk of hospitalization for some babies here in the U.S., he said there is concern, but hopefully not panic. He said he hopes that there is, in fact, some hope on the horizon. In fact, Nicole, today the House of Representatives is actually voting on a bill, hopefully to get more funding to get more baby formula back on our shelves. Nicole? Yeah, lots of parents will certainly appreciate that. Brooke, thank you. Thank you for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.